Here's your 41 Now update, sponsored by Kansas City Regional Association of Realtors. I'm 41 Action News anchor Richard Sharp. Kansas City police are trying to learn what led to a deadly shooting. This marks the 187th homicide in the metro this year. It happened just after 10 last night. Officers were called to 30th and Agnes. When they arrived, they found one man suffering from a gunshot wound. He was pronounced dead at the scene. There is no suspect information at this time. Highway 115 near East Outer Road is back open this morning after a late night accident shut it down. According to Grandview Police, just before 10 last night, two cars were involved in the wreck. One driver was taken to the hospital with serious injuries. Police say speed and alcohol were a factor in this crash. A winter storm put some snags in travel plans across the country, but this morning everything seemed to be on time at KCI. Our crews were there gearing up to head to Seattle for the Chiefs game. They said it was crowded. There were long lines at security and to get tickets. They suggest giving yourself a little bit extra time today when you head to the airport if you have to do that. Remember, you can watch Sunday's game right here on your 41 Action News Station. Our live coverage kicks off from Seattle tomorrow night at 5. Your forecast is next. Did you know not all real estate agents are the same? Look for the Realtor logo to be certain you have a qualified advocate on your side. Visit KCRAR.com for more information. I'm meteorologist Gerard Jabaley. As we move into this week, it looks like it's going to be a pretty nice uh, looking uh, weekend. And next week, it's going to be a little bit wetter, though. We're looking at at least uh, some sunshine for Saturday, Sunday, and uh, even into Monday. But we're going to be seeing a chance for a very light shower late Monday night, maybe Tuesday morning. A few wet snowflakes could be mixed in there, but I would not count on much. The chance of white Christmas very low, but Wednesday and Thursday, a big system will come our way, and that is where we're likely going to be seeing the rainfall, and it will also be rather windy. Luckily, temperatures stay in the 50s until Friday. Remember to get all your latest news and weather updates anytime on KSHB.com. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.